Weekends flooding because Montgomery County authorities say this is a perfect example of why these flood warnings are so important. Lionel Donovan shows us how the county system works to save lives. This device right here on this pole is part of Montgomery County's early warning system to protect people from flooding. It activates when the water level gets to be too high and sends that information directly to county officials. I spoke to an emergency management specialist today and he tells me getting this information can make all the difference. It's important to respect the floodwaters. That advice was on full display this past weekend across Montgomery County as multiple areas were flooded from heavy rain. Around 20 people were reported trapped inside a building in Chevy Chase due to inaccessible roads, and sensors on Sligo Creek showed its water level rising 10 feet in just 30 minutes. I've worked in the county since uh, 2013 for this office, and I've never seen Sligo Creek respond that aggressively. Emergency management specialist Matt Mazurko says much of the county's storm sewer infrastructure is several decades old which can get overwhelmed by heavy rain. So it's important the county stays informed. So this is one of the uh, flood sensors that we have in the county. Early warning systems are set up along each of the county's waterways to alert first responders when the water gets too high and it's time to move. Every sensor at every location has different depth. So what may cause flooding at Sligo Creek at New Hampshire Avenue is different than what may cause flooding at Schuyler Avenue or okay. Houston Avenue. It's because some places the road may go up a little bit, may go down a little bit. Rock Creek's different than Sligo Creek. Right. Cabin John Branch is different than the Hollings River. However, Mazurko says at one point over the weekend, his office received 16 notifications of rising water within just 10 minutes, which is why he says in situations like that, it's vital for people to heed the warnings that are put out. Find a way around and it may take you 10 to 15 minutes more to get home, but it's not worth you getting hurt. It's not worth you losing your car. It's not worth you losing your life. And you can head to our website, WUSA9.com, along with Montgomery County's website to get the most up to date information about flooding events. But Mazurko is also recommending that you pay attention to travel apps like Waze and Google Maps to help find any detours away from flooded roads. From Gaithersburg, Lionel Donovan, WUSA 9. Empower